What's going on guys? It's the Beastly Gamer here. Welcome to my channel. Today is the day I finally get to talk to you guys about what happened in November. We know for the last few months that Microsoft has been on a winning streak. They have been decimating competition when it comes to sales. The Xbox One S has been very popular in the gaming community and for very good reason. It's a beautiful console. Uh, it has it actually outperforms the base Xbox One. It has an Ultra HD Blu-ray player and it streams in 4K. It's an incredible value. That's the most uh, inexpensive 4K Blu-ray player you can buy. And it happens to be an Xbox One at the same time. So there's a lot of people who've been excited about the Xbox One S and they have really been kind of wiping the floor with PlayStation for the last three or four months. November was the month that the PlayStation 4 Pro dropped. I know a few people who picked it up on day one, and here are the sales results after the PlayStation 4 Pro. I'll drop a link in the description. PS4 trailing Xbox One for months finally wins November's sales race in the US. Sony PlayStation 4 finally breaks its monthly sales losing streak to Microsoft's Xbox One, a Sony spokesperson has confirmed. A couple days ago, Sony announced that sales of its PlayStation 4 had topped 50 million units since the game console launched a little before, a little more than three years ago. What it didn't talk about was that since the arrival of the Xbox One S in June, Xbox One sales had been outpacing PS4 sales, according to NPD Group data. But the PS4 has managed to reverse that trend in November. While NPD's monthly sales report won't go public till December 15th, CNET's sister site, GameSpot, confirmed with a Sony spokesperson that the PS4 was the top selling console in the US in November. However, the spokesperson didn't cite specific numbers. Thanks to the release of the Xbox One S coupled with the aggressive pricing, the Xbox has been on top of the console sales chart since July. Meanwhile, Sony released the PS4 Slim in September and PlayStation VR in October and the more powerful PS4 Pro in November. Both companies are running sales on their consoles through the holiday season and shoppers can expect to see a continued $50 discount on various models and bundles along with extra games or game controllers thrown in as deal sweeteners during limited time specials. So PlayStation finally won by how much of a margin we don't know. I kind of felt like this is going to happen. Uh, I know there's a ton of people enjoying the, the pros, especially if you have a 4K TV, it makes a ton of difference. I was at Best Buy today and uh, I saw the PlayStation 4 Pro running on a Vizio 4K TV. And let me just say, it looked phenomenal. I mean, night and day compared to what I see on my 1080p. It's crazy how you don't know what to expect until you're actually face to face with the difference. It's a big difference. I mean, if you're sitting there watching, it was a 55 inch screen and you're looking at a game play in 4K compared to what you're used to seeing, it's not a joke. It's real. It's a big difference uh, which your eyes are able to discern from a 4K image. It's really incredible. Congratulations to PlayStation for winning the month of November. Who knows what will happen uh, in December with the Xbox One S still selling like hotcakes. The PlayStation 4 Pro, of course, being a hot ticket item for the holiday season, especially for Christmas. I'm going to be super excited to see next month what happens this month. You guys let me know what you think in the comments below. Who's going to win December? The Xbox One S is a very popular console right now. And PlayStation 4 Pro is as well. So let me know what you think in the comments. Be sure to give a thumbs up and show support if you enjoyed the video or you found it informative at all. Join the Facebook group, follow me on Twitter, and you can support the channel by clicking on the support tab at BeastlyGamer.com. I'm the Beastly Gamer, and I'll see you guys next time.